Okay, I just definitely heard a freaking hissing sound right behind me. Wow, okay, that was creepy. That was creepy. Hello? Oh, dude, look, 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 look. Look, dude. What does it say? It says dark inside. Yeah. Like inside the slab. What's up guys, my name is Chad. Welcome back to another very creepy, I hope haunted, it looks like this place is crazy haunted, uh, hospital adventure. Tonight we have found our way inside of this massive abandoned hospital. This place was built in the mid 1800s uh, and it was a military hospital. At one time there was actually over 8,000 patients here. At one time, they housed over 8,000 patients here. This place is massive. It is sick. I'm hoping that it's haunted. We are gonna explore the hell out of this place. There is a super crazy morgue in here somewhere. We're gonna try to find it. I have Chris with me from Realm Explorer, and I also have Phil from Darker Image TV and Explore with me, Marlo C, with me exploring around this hospital right now. Right now, I'm in this really creepy room, and I really would like to get out of here because there's a really weird vibe in here. So if you haven't already, make sure you smash the hell out of that like button because this adventure is going to be insane. Make sure you subscribe to the channel for more crazy adventures. So let's get on this crazy adventure, see what we find inside this crazy hospital, and let's remember to never be scared and let's go. Wow, holy crap, dude. There's a giant motor just sitting right here on a pallet jack. I'm not even sure what this was used for. It is beat up. CAV 296. This is crazy. And there must have been some sort of machinery back in here. Oh, yeah, construction area. That's real creepy. Okay. So, not sure what area is what. We're kind of just roaming freely around here right now. Um, again, I'm going to be looking for this morgue because it is beautiful from what I saw. And that's one of the only reasons I came here. This must be like a doctor's nurse's station or something. But we're gonna see what we could find here. There's several floors. There's actually several buildings going on here. So who knows what we're gonna run into. All right, so we've all, we all kind of just separated right now went in our own little directions and uh, I guess we're gonna see where this leads us I'm not really sure what is what in here but a lot of it did fall apart so we're gonna be searching around this building looks really abandoned like really really abandoned falling apart we're gonna see what we can find here. I can't even tell you how insanely creepy this place is. Crazy vibe to it. Photography room? Oh my God, look at this old pay phone, dude. Just sitting here on the corner, old rotary phone. Wow, that's freaking crazy that that would still be there. Actually not even in terrible shape either. Uh, yeah, so we gotta be careful because this is uh, not in the best neighborhood here. And so, whoa, what the hell? That goes down in a little tunnel. And so, uh, 
There could be like crackheads, crazy people, but I guess that's everywhere. You just gotta watch out. Who the hell knows what the hell is going on in here? Room 19, whoa. Holy crap, what's back here? This must have been for like samples and stuff. Holy crap, dude, look at this. Ultra pure water system. What in the hell? That's kind of creepy. What the hell were they using that for? Look at these like tubes or this, uh, 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 I was about to say oxygen. It is a tank though. It is a tank, look at that. That's real creepy. Okay. Holy crap, man. Yeah, so who the hell knows what's even gonna happen in here. Oh, that's another long, creepy ass hallway. Wow, okay. Yeah, this place is pretty nuts. Man, it's like, it's super hot too. somebody like walking I don't know if that was them but like right above me I think they're like right above me on the second floor I don't know I don't know Let's see if we can go okay I just definitely heard a freaking hissing sound right behind me Wow, okay, that was creepy. That was creepy. Hello? <gasps> whoa, 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 whoa. What just happened? What just happened? Something just fell right here. What the hell? Oh shoot. Oh shoot. Dude, there's literally nobody around me. I don't even know where they went. I don't even know where they went. I heard a freaking hissing sound. What's this? Where does this go? To a closet or something? A little back hallway? What the? Okay, now I'm getting a little freaked out. I'm getting a little freaked out. Okay. I don't know what's going on. Let me see if I can find these guys. Because I just don't know, man. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, that freaked me out. That freaked me out, dude. Something fell. Oh, this is the first floor. We, we, we weren't even on the first floor yet. Holy crap. Whoa. Hello? Oh, I know what I'm gonna do. Oh yeah, one E. I know what I'm gonna do right now. I freaking hope that was one of them. Magnet. Basement. Will. Basement. That's where we came in. We just came from down there. This is... Oh. This is a little bit beat up. We're looking for, I, I guess, a section that's not as beat up. Because there is a morgue. Oh, these phones are freaking everywhere. On every corner, man. Oh, things are falling from the freaking ceiling and hitting me. Wow, this is really bizarre. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I already had a couple things happen to me. 
downstairs. Looks like they were gonna do some work and just stopped maybe. Okay, nothing yet on the obelisk device. Whoa, whoa, look at this one. Actually, this is the room where I started out and did my intro. It's just like a room. I think it has a fireplace. Maybe not, I forgot. But yeah, this is a cool room. Look, they had high lights hanging from up there. Look at those bars on the windows. Yo. Did you hear that? Yes. I thought that was you. Where are you? I'm above the clock. Oh, there's a clock there. You heard that, right? You heard that loud. That's why I stopped. I turned around. I, I didn't know where it came from. Where's Bill? I don't know. Yo, that was right on me. Dude, when I was downstairs, yeah. I heard a hissing sound. Really? What, in the basement? Oh, out of the floor right below this one. Yeah, the basement, because this is the first floor. Do you think there's someone upstairs? Show. I don't know, man. I'm gonna go up there right now and check, so. Uh, I'm gonna head up to the. Uh, is there anything cool up there where you are? It's mostly empty rooms, but. I mean, it reminds me of Sarah's You know what I mean? Yeah, it's a little bit more massive, though. Yeah. Um, Alright, I'm gonna head upstairs. I'll stick to the marbles up there. Maybe that was them. No. I don't know. I, I, I thought it was you. No, I. It sounded like something fell or... Yo, it was a loud bang. It was a loud bang. And then I started hearing police sirens on the car break. What's going on, yeah. Oh, there's one of them right there. A cop? No, Phil. A cop? <laughs> yeah. uh, I wouldn't be standing here. Yo, when I was down here, this floor, right? Let me see. Yeah, when I was down here, I went that way. Yeah. And I heard a hissing sound. Really? Swear to God, I might even I caught it on camera, maybe. This is just an empty building. Yeah, it's an empty building, dude. So, we're gonna keep moving around, see what we find. We're looking for the morgue. Trust me when I tell you when we find it, it is amazing. It is literally amazing, Not like nothing you've ever seen. All right, guys, so check out this uh, crazy tunnel, dude. This actually, that was the building we were just in. It goes that far. We're in a totally separate building, but this tunnel is an outside tunnel. Like the doorways are open on both sides. And then there's a little courtyard right here. And then we're gonna go this way. And we're in search of the morgue. But yeah, this place is absolutely freaking bonkers, dude. It is bananas here. There's so much to explore, so many buildings. And we gotta be careful because we're not in a great neighborhood and we did see people walking back here too. So, I'm trying to be extra careful. But we are on a search for this morgue and look at this building, dude. Completely insane. And I'll show you like the whole property. So there's another building over there. There's one back there. This is the one we just came out of, the tunnel. So it's surrounded by abandoned buildings over here. All right, so here we are. Another building, we're going inside. This is super crazy looking. Hopefully this is the one we've been looking for. I hope so too. Okay, let me get the door for you guys. Oh, what a gentleman. Did it lock? Oh, crap. Oh, no. Clickbait. Uh, it locked on the time that you just came open. up here. Oh, oh wait, Jim. It's just a wedge on that piece right there. Damn. All right, that was a fail. Chris lied. He lied to us. He tricked all of us into thinking it was a go. I lied. And it was not a go. Get 
Was that a staircase? No, it's gated. And all these jackets and pillows. Yeah. Holy crap. Right? Yeah, a ton of homeless people here, most likely. Alright, this is like mission 101 right now. We're trying to find a way into this. And yeah, I'm coming. I don't know what they're doing. Wow, it's a place. Oh, there's freaking steps right there. Oh, that door is open up there. I think. Holy cow. Wow. Oh, wow, dude. Wow, this main area. All marble here. Yeah, that's awesome. Holy cow. This place is creepy. What the heck is that? Oh, these are like freaking uh, mailboxes. These are like mailboxes right here. And there's locks in them. It kind of reminds me of Norwich in the sense that it's just destroyed. But it's, it's just... It's enormous. Like, I feel like I'm going to miss something. That's true. We could be getting closer to something. Wow. This is crazy back here. Oh, it's dental. Oh, yeah, dental. See, this is dental. So, all right, they have the cast room right up the hall. Yeah, because these are like dental, dental stations. Look, yeah. mask, gloves. These are like dental stations. Check that out. And I assume... There probably was like a dental chair at one time, yeah, somewhere. Maybe be maybe be one. Wow, this is creepy. Area. Actually, right here, it says right on the wall. Dental clinic, yeah. Yep. Oh, here's like a little storage closet. Surgery, prosthetics, endontics, wow. restorative, and oral hygiene. Oh, this room stinks. There's Marlo right there. Hey, what's going on, guys? Marlo, uh... Slowly Marlo C. <laughs> Slowly Marlo C. She got a little... She passed out. She, she got a little dehydrated. We re, we re amped her up and uh, she's back in the building. So we're all, we're all back together. Plus it's safer because there was like crazy people walking around back here. So, holy crap guys, you look. Oh, I think those are just fireworks. I hope they are. It is the 5th of July right now, but look, I can't get in this room, but there's like cages. I don't know if you can see them. This is like an open air room, and then there's a freaking cage right there. And there's one on the other side to the right. Okay, that's just a thermometer. I'm like, is that the freaking moon? What the hell is going on? But no, there's there's cages back here. I wonder what they were used for, or if there's a way to get back around to the other side somehow. Is there a way to get over there? Yeah. Back here. This is weird. Okay. Oh, no, this isn't even it. It's on the outside of this. I can't even get out there because the door was locked. That's weird. They just had these freaking cages set up there for some reason. I'm not sure exactly why. Check these windows out, you guys. These are sick. They got the vines growing on them. Super duper sick. A lot of the glass, I mean, some of it's broken, but it's mostly still there. Not that destroyed. Maybe it was because it was high up. I don't know, but. Wow, both sides too. This is crazy. Super duper creepy. Wow, and this is a first for me. I, I, I think all of us. I'm pretty sure none of us have been to this hospital before. No. So we're all seeing this for the first time. Never been here before. I actually was excited to come here. And uh, yeah, it's this is a just nuts. Place for all of us, so. Yeah. I mean, we're all just seeing this for the first time. And we're just coming along, you know? Look at this lab. Check out this lab. This lab, right? Yeah. Look at this. Yeah, so this is a lab. Holy crap. You know, you've seen a thousand labs. 
but you haven't yeah. seen this Yeah, you haven't seen this one. Look at these freaking... Look at these containers. Wow. This is crazy. Look at these little test tubes right here. Like a pack of them. Oh my god. That's super sick. Oh, there's a bunch of them, dude. There's a bunch of these little freaking, look at them. These little test tubes. And there's like, these, I assume these were tapes or something? Or, I don't know. Wow. This is crazy, dude. Oh, dude, check this out. This thing is flammable. Whatever this is. I don't know what that is, dude. Let me know in the comments below, you guys. I'm not even sure what that is or what they use that for. I wonder if it says on it, maybe? Something? I don't know. Do not raise hood door. There's like on-off switches. Oh, danger. A Whoa. I can't talk, but danger acid. There's acid in here. It's locked. Holy crap, dude. Okay. Yeah, this is nuts. All right, let's go see what's up on this next floor here. Look, they have the grates to lock. Yo, that's crazy. To lock it. Metal grates. Oh, that looks crazy. Oh, fireplace? Oh, look at that room, dude. At the end. What's over here? Same kind of room, maybe? I don't know. Let's go see what's over here. Oh, you guys, this, this place is insane. Uh, I don't think those are gunshots you hear in the background. I'm pretty sure they're fireworks. Yeah. <laughs> it just would seem like a gunshot because of where we are. You guys, look what we found here. The Civil War Cemetery Exhibit. PowerPoint presentation in progress. So there's, there's an exhibit, or there was an exhibit for Civil War going on in this room. That's probably trashed, and it is. Wow, this is crazy. Everything's just destroyed, obviously. What is up on the wall right here? I can't even say this. The sesquicentennial committee wishes to acknowledge that guy preparing materials for the exhibit. Huh. Something about the sesquicentennial people or something? Oh, 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 oh. For the exhibit? Yeah. <laughs> I thought I heard there was a woman pop in. I know she's been feeling sick, dehydrated. What the hell, man? And so currently, we have lost Phil and Marla. Don't know where they went. And we're walking around trying to look for them. This is a door. So we don't know what's going on. We're kind of just walking around at the moment, trying to find our way out so we can go find those guys because we don't know where they went. And we're currently still looking for the morgue also. We haven't found it yet. Okay, we just heard a sound coming from over there. We just came from that way. We just heard like a clicking sound when we weren't recording. We're looking for these guys. I don't know if they went outside. What the heck is this? All right, so a little weird corner room. Did we come through this door? Yeah. I think we did. Those are for x-rays. Yo, that's crazy. 
right? X-ray machine right there next to the wall. Oh, that breeze feels nice. All right, you guys, we have found the most amazing freaking thing. It's sick. Um, but before I do that and bring you guys into the room, I've already been in there. I'm going to show you this over here. This is really sick. So there was a story of a guy who either lived here or he was a homeless person here or something like that. And he collected all these rocks and they just left them in a room over here. So I kind of want to show you because it's super cool. Actually, there's a lot of stuff here. Look at this. Look at how many rocks are over here, dude. For this guy, they call him the rock man or whatever. Now I can't confirm 100%. I believe he was either a homeless person or a patient here, but he collected rocks and they are everywhere, dude. Literally everywhere. There's some bottles in here. I'm not sure if he was living up in here. But holy crap, dude. I don't even think I knew how far this went back. Like this is insane right here. This is 100% insane. It's a lot more rocks than I thought it was. But yeah, this is like the rock man's collection right here. Look, there's even some marble stuff. I'm not sure if that's his, but let's get over to this. I'm gonna show you. Oh, geez, they're making noise. I'm gonna walk you guys right over to this sick morgue that we've been looking for forever. And it is right over here. I think there's some other stuff down here, but we, we mostly made it through this video. Uh, not really, uh, oh, what is this? A freaking elevator that just stuck? That is an elevator right next to the morgue. Bring the bodies up and down, I assume. Capacity 30. That seems, actually, no, no, that seems right. It's pretty big. But yeah, check this out back here, you guys. This is everything, dude. Right here. There's Phil with his sweaty back. Sweaty Phil. Sorry. Very hot. <laughs> oh my God, it is brutal. But guys, check this sick morgue out right here. We're actually going to set up and investigate. I might actually lay inside the morgue. See what happens there. But yeah, this is it. This is it. And look, they have like seating. I'm not sure if they would seat people just in here. What was that? What was the story behind that? Like well, patients? Yeah, Why would... there would be people watching. It. This would be a learning experience. People would be learning how to perform autopsy here. And so they would watch the procedure. Yeah, well, there you go. Watch. So I guess, uh, this is almost like a college classroom. Like, hey, let's watch the autopsy. Is that blood inside of there or is it paint? It's probably paint. It's red it's still. I mean, what the hell? Yeah, I think it's, I don't know. No, it looks like blood because it streaks like blood, dude. It streaks just like blood when you have a cut and you're lazy and you don't want to wipe it and you wipe it on something, that's what it looks like. So these I assume were like coolers right here. Oh my goodness, man. I, I This has just been an absolutely amazing find right here. Here's the slabs. I could probably fit in here. Look at this, man. There's 12 of these here. I mean, this is just bonkers, dude. I don't know if this is like real blood on here either. It might not even be blood. Actually, I think it is because it turned more like brownish type color over time. It might be blood, man. Let me know what you guys think. But we made our way kind of like through the other buildings and didn't find much. They were mostly destroyed uh, and there wasn't much in there. We found a lab, I think, in one of the other buildings. So this is exactly what we've been looking for. Oh, this, this is insane. I love this. This is too much, man. I wish you guys could be here to see this in person because this is literally amazing. 
Here's the table right here where they perform the autopsies. And the lights up above. Holy cow. Super duper sick. So check this out up top here. Like this is the seating. It's almost it's like a freaking Roman Coliseum. Right? And and so the, you know what I mean? And so there's uh there's more like samples up here. Look at this. I'm touching it with my bare hands now, but dude, these had to be for blood samples, man. Look at this, it's just sitting here. I took my gloves off like an idiot. And these are blood samples, man. Just sitting here on these shelves that are right behind the seating right here. Holy crap. I don't know what you guys think. This is literally amazing to me. This is amazing. I've, yeah, dude, I've never seen anything like this either. Yeah, dude, this is sick, man. This was worth coming out here to see. It was worth the freaking whole drive. Seriously, man. Look at all these more samples here. They're all, they're all over the place, dude. And some of them have blood streaks through them. Oh, yeah, there's some on the shelves over here, bro. I mean, that's just incredible, though, that they left this. They did over 15,000 autopsies down here, and they would actually have people set up sitting in these seats right here. And they would just watch and learn how to perform the autopsy. That was the reasoning behind the seating in here. So, we're gonna set up some stuff. We're gonna see if we can talk to some ghosts, man. What's going on on the uh, basement? Oh, temperature. What? I feel like we're all okay out of here right now. What's the temperature like inside the, the actual slabs? I don't know. I got 82. At 82 it says well that's now because it's hot but like would they would they put them in there cold i mean yeah cold sure right this was set at a specific count at all times or the inside i mean yeah yeah what temperature was it trip what the hell okay uh negative 10 is the lowest it's been going off over here dude this thing it goes up to yellow see oh I don't know. That's if, fireworks. I don't, I don't know if this affects it, but it's weird. This has been going off. What about in here? Oh, a little bit. All right. So let's start a spirit box. Actually. Oh, this is crazy. Oh, dude, look, 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 dude. What does it say? It says dark inside. Yeah. Like inside the slab. Sure you know? know they're saying that it's dark inside there when they're buried in there. Not buried in there. You, you know what I'm saying. Look at that. There's just a blade sitting right here. I wonder if they use that to cut open some bodies. Oh, look. Wound. What's that? Wound. Wound. Were you wounded when you came in to this room so they could work on you? Can you touch some of the other colors on that? Can you touch some of the other colors? We'll know if you're here if you touch that device. It will change different colors. Please. Let us know that you're here by touching that. Just wave your hand through it. I'm scared. Scared? And it said it weird. Yeah. Kind of like stretched oh. it out. Oh, it said scared. Oh, dude. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Don't be scared. Bro. We're not going to hurt you. We just want to know who you are. Were you scared to die? That's why you said that? Huh. Can you do something else? Can you, can you make a noise somewhere else? Just 
so much oh. noise pollution. Oh. Yeah, there's a lot of road noise. There is some road noise, but look, 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 look. It was gone. Can you touch that device again, please? That's weird. It almost felt like something was like near me. Dude, even over here. What, um... Repeating the signal. Yeah, the chat's definitely getting hits on the too. Even over here, I mean, it, it mostly goes to yellow. Really? But it's, I've seen it go to red a couple times. This freaking morgue is so creepy, dude. It's so creepy. We found blood samples. I mean, it's insane what we found in here. Look, there's like draining sinks in here. Yeah, so here it is. We're actually gonna shut our lights off real quick. Oops. There we go. You want to light the Yeah, I shut my light off. Dude, this thing is still, look at it. I don't know if something's like just around me. All right guys, so we investigated a little bit here. Uh, it is hot as hell. I'm starting to feel a little bit nauseous. Uh, Marlo definitely has not been feeling good this whole time and did a lot of driving today. She's been one that's been driving us around. So uh, let me know if you saw or heard anything. We got a couple weird things down here, but it was more cool just to see the morgue. Let me know in the comments if you saw or heard anything that we might've missed. Go over and subscribe to uh, Realm Explorer. Explore with me, Marlo C, and uh, Darker Image TV. They came along on the trip, so go check them out. I'll leave their links down below. And uh, we're gonna get up out of here. Uh, this was a crazy find, and uh, it took us a little while, so we're kind of tired. So we're gonna get up out of here. Always remember to never be scared. We're gonna see you guys in the next adventure. Peace.